Guy Verhofstadt has ordered for a Brexit group to be investigated after Leave.eu changed address to Ireland in order to retain an EU domain name. Leave.eu, the pro-Brexit lobby group, has transferred its website registration address to the European Union in a bid to avoid losing its EU-level domain. The EU suffix is reserved for EU citizens and entities, which now excludes 80,000 British websites. Now, Brexit critic and MEP, Guy Verhofstadt, has urged the Commission to closely investigate whether all the criteria has been fulfilled. He tweeted, ironic this, Brexit campaign organization moves to the EU to keep their registration. I hope at EU Registry and at EU Commission will closely investigate whether all criteria have been fulfilled. An Irish MP has called for an investigation into how the group was able to secure a web address. Neil Richmond wrote to ComReg, the Irish communications regulator, echoing Mr. Verhofstadt's demands. His letter read, I am deeply concerned by this move and would like to receive assurance as to whether this move is a legitimate way to retain the web domain following the withdrawal of the United Kingdom from the European Union. He went on to tell The Guardian, I see Leave.eu to be an odious organization with a dubious reputation that spews bile, often directed specifically at Ireland. I am asking for scrutiny of their operations and qualifications. Leave.eu is a website funded by UKIP founder Aaron Banks who campaigned for Brexit. While not affiliated with the official Vote Leave campaign group, it was influential in the lead up to the Brexit referendum in 2016. In a bid to avoid losing its domain name, which would affect its brand and search rankings, its parent company, Better for the Country, changed its address to a town in Ireland. According to the Irish Times, they have moved their address office to Waterford, a town on Ireland's southwest coast. Andy Wigmore, who in the group with Mr. Banks, told The Independent, yes we did it and why not? Anyone can do it and thousands of companies have. He argued the move would not include the transfer of any staff or economic activity out of the UK to the EU. Sean Power, an Irish businesses whose name appears on the domain registration, claimed he has never heard of the company.